Hey, this is Monica back with the Dr. Bernstein's Diet. Um, so I have officially completed my first week. Uh, so I'd like to go over what happened and how it went and the shots and the food and the whole thing. So I'll start by saying that the shots, not as bad as I thought. They certainly don't hurt when they go in, but definitely sting afterwards. Um, I have a few little welts on my butt because you have to have your um, injections in the butt uh, for the first week and then you can change to your stomach or your thigh which I don't think I'm going to do. The butt actually works for me. It's not too painful. So um, for all my anxieties about the needles, not too bad. So I'm really happy about that. Okay. So uh, first, after I did my uh, measurements, um, I have my handy dandy food sheet here. And um, their weigh scale weighed me in at 243.8. So I wasn't too bad on my um, home scale, not too far off. Uh, so if you have any questions about meal plans, about what I particularly have done or what I've been following, um, you can just write, and I, write me um, a comment and I'll try to write back. Um, so the first two days I try to do simple stupid, as simple as I could, eat everything that I'm allotted, and I'll tell you I'm absolutely starving, starving for the first three days. Hunger, headaches, irritable, everything, it's just, and I'm told this is normal because you basically your whole body is just, doesn't know what's happening, it's in shock. So, uh, the first three days, really, really unpleasant. Um, still the, the fourth and the fifth, it's still kind of uh, on and off, but not as bad. And um, I saw the doctor today, which is Friday, my third shot of the week. Um, and she, I was so good at burning ketones when they did my dipstick for urine that she gave me an extra protein, which I was like, praise the Lord, because God, those two proteins were just killing me. And later to find out that because I'm working out and burning so much calories, I'm essentially eating nothing. No wonder I'm starving. So if you're basically someone who sits in an office all day or doesn't do much physical activity, you probably wouldn't be as hungry as I have been. So I'm an, I have a natural born athlete and I, I don't even know what it feels like to sit on my butt for, for five days in a row and do nothing and watch TV all day. I just don't do it. I'm always walking around, moving. Um, I work in a hospital, so I'm on my feet all the time. So she told me that's why I'm starving. It's not as bad for regular people who don't do as much as I do. So she upped my potassium pills to six a day instead of four and gave me an extra protein, which I was like, thank you. Um, and the great news is in five days, I lost eight pounds. I can't believe it. I can tell immediately that I am less bloated because I'm not eating as much salt or processed food. Um, just feeling good so far. Now it's a great positive step to start the second week. I just bought my second and third week today and I am now totally fired up to get keep going and um, get better. I can't wait to see how I can do. Um, I haven't lost eight pounds. It took would take me a month for that so I'm just I'm ecstatic. I can't even tell you. I can't even hold it in. So um, I'm really happy about it. Um, totally worth the injections. You just get used to it. And for the, I had nightmares about injections, and I'm fine with it now. Everything's cool. Um, but one thing I did do, and I did, I'm so organized that I organized my food for two weeks and um, worked everything out. But you know what? The three days of absolute starvation to me, I had to change my what I was eating. I was trying to go for easy. Easy meaning cut up tomatoes and have egg whites. Um, that just doesn't work. It's not sufficient. It's just not enough. So I started to really dive into this book. Stop getting lazy, get off my butt and start cooking. And I started cooking up a storm yesterday. I cooked for five hours, made four different things, froze them and you know what? Ready to go. So, um, and you know what? It's much better. I'm not hungry. It's hungry today. And, um, Everything has just been fine. So, so far, I went from 243.8 pounds. I am now 236.2. And their goal weight for me for two weeks was between 233 and 236. So I'm already getting in that goal frame for a two-week span. So I'm going to keep going. Um, and I hope that this helps anyone. If you have any questions, let me know and I'll answer it and if you even want to know what kind of fitness programs I'm doing
it's cool too because I'll let you know whatever you want to know. Um, the only surprising factor the doctor told me today was don't do as much fitness. Don't, don't, don't. And I'm like, oh my gosh, really? That seems counterintuitive. No, apparently not. Apparently that it's actually worse for you because your your fat burning will start to it'll start to burn a different way and your body's in too much shock right now with the diet. So you really need to get let your body get used to it. Don't go like balls to the wall like I am and going crazy with fitness and eating and just really take it easy. Take your time. Let the injections do what they're supposed to do. Let the let the ketones work. Like you know, just kind of calm down. And um, so that's what that's what's going on right now and uh, I'll check in next Friday and and hope that I have great success again and I hope that uh, anyone out there trying you know skeptical of this I'm not saying go try it now oh my god because one person lost weight but you know what I haven't lost weight in five years not five years on my own and now it's eight pounds in one week I just I I want to cry it's just it's a great feeling and I'm really motivated to keep going and uh, I'm so happy I took this step so um, Hope everyone enjoys the weekend, and I will talk to you next Friday. Okay, bye.